Gata Gilet. Pretty, pretty empty. It's very empty. That's a shame. Cheap couple of days so far, really, and it nobody bought much. Right then, set of butchers. Still here. Keep on talking, otherwise I'll get a copyright strike. Oh, 
めんなさいね Nothing is. Richard's slow cooker. So, it's a twenty quid brand new. Wallace and Gromit going crackers game. Okay, so before we get into a few sales for the last few days, here's what I've picked up for the last few days. Samuel Windsor handmade shoes. I paid, I think I paid £7.50. Sounds about right. Um, here we go, £7.50. Lovely jubbly. Also bought a Le Crusoe pot for £2.50, I think. There we go. I know what I'm talking about. For £2, we've got some Jurassic World Lego. Now, the only reason why I picked it up is because we are due Jurassic World Dominion at some point this year. Uh, with the two that there, probably get about 10, 15 pounds back. Two pound for a Pokemon Center 2019 Pikachu plush. There is a high possibility my daughter will nick this before I have the chance to sell it. But this was two pounds. For three pounds, we've got Chicken Run Escape from Tweedy's Farm board game. I think they're doing a sequel it's brand new uh, someone was asking around 10 pound for a pre-owned version three pound should be very very safe and then the last purchase of the week is a lord of the rings the fellowship of the ring pewter and bronze effect chess set paid a tenner i'm i'm reckoning between 25 and 30 pounds back the new show that's coming out very very soon will hopefully bump up the price a little bit it's not a lot but we've sold a four pin set from Doctor Strange for $8.99 all in. And it has those pins with it. So you've got the Eye of Agamotto, uh, you've got the thingy in the background of the Sanctum Centaurum and Doctor Strange himself. But yeah, one have sold for $8.99 all in. It'll go as a large letter. <laughs> Oh yes, back into the loft. We've only got one item to grab. And I'm hoping it's in here because it's not in the garage, which is where I thought it was. Ah, oh, there it is. Oh, I can see it. So, bought this, God knows how long ago, for a fiver, I think. 
I've just sold it for 30 quid plus, no, including shipping. But that's over two kilos, I would say. If not, maybe it's on the verge. It might just be on the, that's all gonna fall down. Everything is going Pete Tong. Um, but yeah. Oh, I've got more Heelys to list. Some, I've got some downstairs. Um, so yeah, 30 pound, all in, brand new, never been used, etc. That's probably gonna be it for the day. Okay, I must warn you, I probably sound <laughs> A bit rough. Ah, oh, at least I know it's not COVID. Right, we've got a few things. Oh, actually, I think we'll start off down here, which we're looking for a Blu-ray of Star Trek Into Darkness. Which I'm hoping is... Oh, I definitely need two hands. There we go. That was worth it, wasn't it? Star Trek, an outer... Focus Star Trek Into Darkness, £2.35 all in. Yay! Big bucks. Um, oh, I feel rough as hell. Minecraft, I think that's downstairs uh, into the Minecraft Xbox 360. Uh, also sold this guy for £25. Oh, kind of need that it's just a jack-in-a-box hungry caterpillar uh, and what else do we have uh, yeah I'm really not with it still <laughs> uh, I need to go to sleep um, I'm looking for there should be a dinosaur up here which is that dinosaur that is sold by the GSP. A stupidly large dinosaur at that. Um, he's from 1974 and he sold for 9.99 plus shipping. Um, then I'm looking for... Oh, I might have to just grab everything and I'll show you afterwards. Right, well that wasn't too hard. Um, the the Levi's thing, it looks like that. Uh, that sold for fifty nine ninety nine plus shipping. It's it's a really nice jumper. I'm just confused why it's sold now when summer's around the corner. Uh, and then we sold two playmats, one at twelve ninety nine plus shipping, and then the other one at seven ninety nine plus shipping. But there we go, sales and stuff. We have sold. A Sonic Superstar Tennis on the Nintendo DS for a grand total of $4.99, including free delivery. From a Lego bundle the other week, for $9.99 all in, we have sold this Ninjago Legacy figure, limited edition Garmadon. That looks like it says Garmadon to me. There we go. Done. Lovely jubbly. One more item to get. I just hit my head. Well, one more item right now, and it's another Ultra Pro Mat. It is another Amonkhet, wherever that is. Uh, $9.99 plus shipping cost me about half of that. So I've still not quite decided what on earth I'm going to do video-wise. Um, yeah, it's a bit all over the place at the moment, but I've... At the time of recording this, it is currently Sunday, and I've got things to put away. I've also got things to pick up as well, ready for packaging. So I've got to put all this away for... Oh, this is the bit I hate, is putting stuff away. Possibly worse than listing things. This is the bit that I really do hate. However, that was absolutely awesome. Before I forget, at the bottom of the stairs, you can see those classic Barker Brogues, size 12E. They've sold again! Uh, this time for $35.99 plus sign for shipping, lovely jubbly. And F1 2017 on the PS4, I think sold for about seven or eight pounds, including postage. So those are good to go. Somewhere I do have an IKEA egg. Um, that has sold, but this has also sold, which 
what is that? It's a Design Michael Warnhammer Nightmare. Whatever that is, uh, I sold it for fourteen pounds ninety nine plus signed for shipping. But there you go. That's because of Kieran. That one. I would try and be clever about it, but I I kind of found the IKEA egg lamp. It's there, as you can tell. I put it away really carefully. Uh, that can go over there. Oh, this sold for. It sold up right after the other IKEA thing, but to the wrong, to a different person, not the wrong person. Uh, sold for twenty nine ninety nine, plus sign for shipping. <sighs> sold two lots of Le Crusoe, so I bought, God, eight of twenty quid. I've now sold two lots of two for seventeen ninety nine plus shipping. It's not a great deal, but I just wanted to get it out because like eight of those takes up a fair bit of room so I just wanted to get rid of some and now I can just sit back and relax but yeah 17.99 I think times two for those four there we have sold this big old beast of a swimming pool for 134.99 all in uh, I don't remember how much it cost me it was one of these middle of little Audi things, but it's it weighs a freaking ton. Look, net weight 26.5 kilos, gross weight 29.9 kilos. It's freaking heavy. I'm just glad it's gone. Oh, and, and sold a Sega wallet for 9.99 all in, cost me about a quid. I've got bloody loads of them, so I'm not going to show you because it's too bloody big and bulky, but. The Sony mini disc deck that I bought about a month ago for £20, including some mini discs. Uh, the player alone has sold for £134.99 plus shipping. Second time I've sold it, the first person just didn't bother buying, which is annoying, but you know, such is life. But we've sold it again! £134.99 plus shipping. Lovely jubbly. Okay, and now to find. Oh, that's blurry as hell. Uh, on the Game Boy. Ah, oh, what happened there? I've got no idea, but I survived. It's fine. Uh, looking for Bomb Jack, which I'm hoping is inside here. Which it doesn't actually look like it is, does it? It should just be sitting. Uh, is it in there? No. Is it in there? Is it that one there? There it is. 17.99 I think it was. Yeah, 17.99 plus one pound five pence shipping. So should be able to keep it underneath the 100 grams. And it'll go as a large letter. As in a rigid cardboard box, like DVD sized large letter because protection. So we've sold this Sylvanian family set for 39.99 all in. It's going out via the GSP and this Caitness paperweight for $9.99 plus shipping. But it's technically going out late, so I'm going to bump it up to first class. Okay, so home stretch of eBay sales. Dino Crisis 2 sold for $34.99 plus shipping and Crash Bandicoot 2 sold for $19.99 plus shipping. Yes, I left that price tag on there because I don't know where it's from and character I suppose right then so for the last time this video we are going into the loft where I'm fairly certain one of those Wii games is sold which is oh actually there's two little sales from here $12.99 all in for new Super Mario Bros lovely jubbly that was bought at the weekend and Lego Batman 2 sold for $3.99 all in. And I'm hoping that in here, if I put it away properly, oh, I bloody did. I love me sometimes. Um, Tyco Python remote that I bought as part of a bundle for 15 quid. This 
no, oh, it wasn't a bundle. This was the broken RC. So I've done the RC separately as spares and repairs, so that someone can just sort of rip it apart and use the wheels and do God knows what else. Um, but that sold for 19.99 plus shipping. I paid a fiver for the lot, so I'm in profit already. Absolutely fantastic. We've also sold Kung Fu Panda, part of a bundle from the other week. Uh, it didn't sell for a huge amount. It sold for 9.99 all in, which isn't bad, but every little helps. But there we go, the video is over and we should now hopefully be back to some sort of normality. Three videos a week for the time being and um, we'll change it as and when it's required. But yeah, all in all, not bad. Still recovering from the flu, it's still lingering, but I'm, I'm like 80% better. So can't complain whatsoever. But all in all, somewhat decent week considering it's not even over yet. It's only Wednesday. But yeah, I'll catch you guys soon. Au revoir.